I'm standing on my roof as the whole sky is lighting up in a display of fireworks. It's interesting to try to get it all because there's so much going off at once everywhere. And it's so fast that by the time you move over to try to grab the shot, the shot might be gone. So I will do my best. Oh, missed that one. There's some going off over on the other side, but the tree's blocking it, so I can't get at it. Come on. Ah, tree blocking. Oh well. <laughs> I guess there's a downside to all these trees. And as I zoom in on this light here, you can see all the fog in the air. <laughs> that's the sulfur from the fireworks. I mean, that's how much fireworks are being blown off. That, like, the sulfur from the fireworks is everywhere. Yeah, miss that one. Miss that. There's some going off behind the tree. The tree's blocking the view though. Whoop! That one gonna. Oh, that one wasn't anything. Oh, there's some behind that tree over there. Wow, I don't know how good you can, you can see this in here, but there's a lot of sulfur fog. Crazy. Now I missed that one. Yeah. Whoop. There, there's some. See, I have two eyes and peripheral vision, whereas the camera does not. Oh, miss that one. There's someone shooting up some smaller ones over here. Oh, Jose, can you see any bed bugs on me? If you do take a few, I'll give them all to you. Why pay to go see a fireworks show when the fireworks show comes to me? And thanks to modern technology, all the high grade stuff is easily accessible to the average individual for a reasonable price. So. That's why these skies have only been like this for maybe about the last 10 years or so on the 4th because um, improvements in manufacturing technology leads to cheaper prices, which leads to everybody goes out and gets them. So, go, oh, no. come on. Woo, nice! That's a good one. Ah, on the roof right outside my window is the best possible view. Apparently the mosquitoes are starting to think so too. Get the hell away. <laughs> oh, miss that. Some over there, some over there, some going off over there. <laughs> like I said, 
It's an interesting trick. To really do this perfect, you'd need a camera set up to capture all 360 degrees of the sky, you know, one for each direction, north, south, east, west. Then load all those frames into an editor and, uh, you know, keep only the, the best ones and, and not dead sky. I'm gonna end this video before it gets too huge, but I'll take several, no worries.